With a perfect timeline, I will tell you how much automobiles have evolved over the last 140 years. But we can't start without briefly mentioning some of the people who made cars possible before 1886. Leonardo da Vinci invents the self-propelled car. This happens many years before anyone else is even thinking about automobiles. However, the car remains a sketch on paper and is never actually made. This self-propelled car is not a car like the ones we see today. It is more similar to a cart and does not have a seat. In 2004, a replica of da Vinci's car is finally crafted. It can be seen on display at the Institute and Museum of the History of Science in Florence, Italy. Nicola Joseph Cugno builds the first self-propelled road vehicle in France. This vehicle is a tractor for the French army. It has three wheels and moves at about 2.5 miles per hour. English engineer and inventor Samuel Brown invents an internal combustion engine. It has separate combustion and working cylinders and is used to power a vehicle. Belgian engineer Jean-Joseph Etienne Lenoir invents the horseless carriage. It uses an internal combustion engine and can move at about three miles per hour. This is the first commercially successful internal combustion engine. Otto builds the four-cycle internal combustion engine, which is the prototype for modern car engines. So let's start with the Benz patent motor car, which we can now call the first car, or you can ride on it the first saleable version of something that had three wheels and could drive. Michelin created the first pneumatic tire for cars, made out of reinforced rubber and inflated with compressed air. Frenchman Camille Genazzi's electric car broke the one mile a minute barrier. One mile a minute is 97 kph. The Ford Motor Company began selling 1,700 cars in its first year of business. The Ford Motor Company debuted the first Model T automobile, which gained the nickname Tin Lizzy. The first electric starters were invented, eliminating the cranking mechanism needed to start cars until this time. The electric ignition debuted one year later. A police officer invented the first electric traffic light. It was installed on a street in Cleveland, Ohio, two years later. The Ford Motor Company invented and began using the first moving assembly line for building cars. Dodge was the first company to introduce a car body that was made completely of steel. First windscreen wipers fitted to a motor car. Willie's Knight of the USA fits mechanical windscreen wipers to a car. Electric headlights are introduced in automobiles. The US shifts automobile production to the war effort due to its involvement in World War I. Chevron Supreme was first introduced as unleaded gasoline. Hydraulic brakes were used in automobiles for the first time. The development of the high-speed diesel engine would lead to new car designs. The first cigarette lighter was added to cars. John Godfrey Parry Thomas set a new land speed record, driving at 272 kilometers per hour. Cadillac V16 was launched. It was a dream car. Mercedes-Benz introduced the first independent front suspension system, which greatly improved the handling and ride of these cars. Ferdinand Porsche, a relentless and visionary auto engineer who was also a member of the Nazi party, started making cars in 1931. Galvin Manufacturing created and installed the first car radio. The Delaware Company devised the first flashing turn signal. First diesel passenger car introduced Mercedes-Benz introduces the 260D, the first diesel passenger car. By 1939, there was a 15-month waiting list for the car. Volkswagen started producing the Beetle in Germany. The first air conditioning system was added to vehicles by the Nash Motor Company. Karl Pabst designed the Jeep, which became an important vehicle for the Allied forces in World War II. Ponton or pontoon styling is an automotive design genre that spanned roughly from the 1934's 1960s when pontoon-like bodywork enclosed the full width and uninterrupted length of a car body, eliminating previously distinct running boards and articulated fenders. Lincoln Continental 1941 model has been introduced. John Cobb drives a Railton Mobile Special 634 kmh at the Bonneville Salt Flats in Utah. The first all-Australian car was the Holden 48215 and was commonly known as the FX. Chrysler unveiled the first car key that could start the engine all on its own. Before this, the key was merely used as a lock of sorts to control the electrical circuit. The Oldsmobile Rocket 88 is introduced as the first muscle car with a V8 engine. The first power steering has been introduced. The Buick Skylark has been introduced. 
The same year the Chevrolet Corvette went on sale, the competition was fierce. Cars were now favored not only for their power, but also for their creative exterior design, just like the Chevrolet Bel Air. The first seatbelt was installed in a car in Sweden. The date of the first implementation is disputed. The first cruise control applied on a car. BMC Mini starts production. Alec Isignosis designed the Mini as a tiny car with a roomy interior at an affordable price. The original design Mini was made until 2000. Toyota starts sales in the US for the first time with the Corona model. The Cadillac Eldorado and Chevrolet Impala were in a big race. Automobili Ferruccio Lamborghini was officially founded on October 30th, 1963. The Ford Mustang that will be used in many movies in the world of cinema was born. Automatic transmissions with three speeds debuted and quickly became standard. Cassette decks began appearing in some cars. Music was now mobile. The first airbag was fitted to GM cars Pontiac, Oldsmobile and Cadillac. Simple digital displays started to be added to cars. The world witnessed a great success. Toyota makes the Corolla the best-selling car in the world. Richard Noble drove a car in the Black Rock Desert, setting a new land speed record of 1,019 kilometers per hour. The first car CD players were installed. Anti-lock braking systems became available on US cars. Chrysler began the first production airbag, initially just on the driver's side. Electromagnetic parking sensors started to be added to cars. Parking became very easy. The first onboard diagnostic computers were installed in Ford vehicles, eventually becoming the standard for all vehicles. The thrust SSC, supersonic car, broke the land speed record by traveling at 12 and 28 km h. BMW introduces the sports SUV concept with the X5 model. Hybrid motors that combined a combustion engine with an electric engine were rolled out in the Toyota Prius. Reversing cameras were added to the Nissan Primera for the first time. The first intelligent parking assist system was added to some vehicles by Toyota. The Bugatti Veyron 16.4 becomes the fastest commercial production car. The car has the potential to travel at speeds of up to 431 km h. In response to concerns about the world's finite supply of oil, Honda reveals the first production-ready hydrogen car, the FCX Clarity. After the car industry does not comply with a voluntary commitment to limit CO2 emissions in new cars, the EU introduces its first law to do this. Paul Drayson breaks the electric world land speed record in his Lola EV vehicle. The car hit a top speed of 204 meter piece. Elon Musk debuted the first autopilot technology on his Model S, making it the first car that could steer and change lanes independently of the driver. The FIA will launch the first electric car championship in 2014. Google announced a plan to debut a self-driving car, which became Waymo. The European Union has agreed to ban the sale of new gasoline and diesel cars from 2035 to speed up the transition to electric vehicles and combat climate change. By 2023, the leader in electric car sales is Tesla, owned by Elon Musk. If you want to see more videos like this on our channel, please subscribe, like the video and don't forget to comment.